Hey guys, I wanted to talk a little bit today about fuel. So early on in my health journey, I went to a training by Amber and Jared Smithson where they shared a comparison between fueling your body to fueling a vehicle. And I thought it was such a great comparison, um, so many parallels and such a good visual. I wanted to share that with you guys today. So over spring break, which was last week for us in Utah, um, we drove from Utah to California on a road trip. And you guys know if you're driving your car, maybe across the country, you pull over about every two to three hours to put fuel in your car. Um, so when our gas tank started running on empty, we were always searching out a gas station and an exit. So we'd pull off and we would put the highest performance gas in the car that we could. Um, we did that for, for several reasons. Um, one, we didn't wanna run out of gas. We would have a breakdown that would cost us time and money. Um, number two, we wanted the best performance possible. And number three, we wanted great gas mileage. So our bodies are no different. They really need fuel every two to three hours. And they love high quality fuel just as much as our car does. Our body is a machine and it performs the best with the highest quality fuel. Now, I think one thing that's kind of hard is that we might look in the mirror and think, we're not a high performance machine quite yet. And so it's tempting to feed our body garbage if we don't look like a Ferrari yet, right? Um, but the important part is, as soon as we start fueling our body like the high performance machine that it can be, it starts to turn into the high performance machine. And it takes time, but it has to be fueled with the highest quality fuel you can give it. Um, if you feed your body every two to three hours, your blood sugars stay balanced, and you are gonna have no breakdowns, you're gonna have the highest performance that you possibly can have, and you are gonna feel so great. There are so many good, good things about fueling your body proactively every two to three hours. I know for myself, um, I used to kind of wear that badge. Do you guys know that badge that people wear? I haven't eaten in blank hours. You know, we kind of tend to think, oh, somehow we're gonna lose weight if we go all day long without eating. But what happens is our metabolism just shuts down. It just kind of turns off because it doesn't know if it's gonna get fuel. And so it's kind of like our gas mileage just went way down. So we always wanna keep our body running like a machine and fuel it proactively. It's such a good thing to do for our body. Another crazy thing that Jared shared that I thought was, this is just an image I've never forgotten, is he said, how crazy would it be if we went to the gas station and someone was driving a car and they filled up the gas tank and when the gas tank was full, they opened up the trunk and they filled up the trunk with fuel too. Like, how crazy would that be? Can you imagine what a waste of money? It would ruin your car. You can't use the gas that you put back there and it's very expensive. So why would we ever put fuel in our trunk? So I've thought about that a lot, like fuel my fuel tank, but don't put fuel in your trunk. So keep that in mind when you're planning your meals. Um, you wanna give your body just enough to, to run perfectly for three hours and no more because anything we give it over the amount that it needs it's just going to stick it in the trunk and your body just doesn't really know what to do with that so what it does is it just stores it as fat our bodies are so smart so our body is really good at storing fat and it will just stick it in our trunk but it can't really use it right now so um just remember that little visual i hope that helps someone also um Wanted to give a little plug for my Optavia fuelings. If you guys find that eating every two to three hours is a little bit time consuming, a little bit stressful for you, and maybe you're, it just makes your brain explode to try to think of what to eat every two to three hours. This is what I love about our Optavia fuelings. First of all, I love that they're called fuelings because they are the perfect fuel to put in your body. High performance fuel. They've got protein, fat, carbohydrate, vitamins, and probiotics in every fueling. And you eat a fueling on our program every two to three hours. So it's really goof proof. So when I eat my fueling, I think about putting 91 octane gas in my tank. And I think this is exactly what my body needs. Um, if you're not on our health program, focus on giving your body the best balance you can of the perfect fuel you can give it. It needs protein, it needs fat, it needs carbohydrates, and it needs those every two to three hours along with water. So this 
there's a million of these different bottles. This is a 40 ounce, and I find if it has the straw lid, it just makes it so much easier for me to drink my water. I drink about three of these a day. I need a lot of water, but I find if it has a sipper lid and if it's a big bottle, it's so much easier to get my water in. So um, perfect fuel and water all day long will end up giving you the best performance and it'll end up creating that high quality machine that you want. Okay, have a great day, you guys.